Okay, so I want everybody to close their eyes for me. And picture it's a nice dark night, perfect temperature. You're snuggled up in your bed, just falling asleep, and you're so cozy. Close your eyes, Geo. You're so cozy, and <laughs> you having a great dream, and all of a sudden you hear somebody downstairs, and you wake up from your dream. Okay, open your eyes. I'm Gabriella. I'm Carly. And we're introducing to you hands. It's predatory action negators. So in these situations where maybe there is somebody in your house, what are you supposed to do? Normally, the <laughs> options, most people's first options, and the options that are currently available, are guns and knives. There are so many drawbacks to having these weapons in your house. Most people have guns locked up very securely. If you have that gun locked up in your <coughs> house and it's locked up properly so your kids can't get to it, and so it's going to be safe, by the time you get it, it's probably going to be too late. If you grab a knife from your kitchen, there's a very good chance of you maybe falling or it's dark, you're tired, so you're rubbing your eyes looking for a knife and then you fall. And that's not going to be good either. And the worst case scenario is that whoever is in your house takes your weapon and uses it against you. That's why we are presenting our new product, Pam. What a better way to defend yourself. Um, okay, so thank you, Gabriella. I'm going to talk about um, the two models of pans we currently have available. And they are the Bludgeoner X9000, which was our original design, and the Bludgeoner Hybrid. Now, the Bludgeoner X9000 is made of solid cast iron, and the basic model has a 9-inch diameter base with a 5-inch handle. So, um, it's very heavy and it's hard to puncture, so it offers effective defense as well as offense. So it's basically the Thor's hammer of pants. Um, <laughs> but because it is um, as heavy as it is, it's best suited for someone who's probably a little bit taller, that their height gives them a significant leverage, and a little bit stronger. So, Brendan, you would want a Bludgeoner X 9000, whereas I probably wouldn't do so well with that. I'm short and also pretty weak. Um, and the Bludgeoner Hybrid uh, was our sort of our follow-up model, and that is made of stainless steel with a copper core and a Teflon coating. Um, now this is significantly lighter than the X9000. The basic model clocks in at around three pounds as opposed to eight pounds, and it has an 11 inch um, base and a six inch handle so if you're short or maybe you're not particularly strong, this gives you much more of an advantage. Um, but moving on to the um, custom options we have, um, we offer a variety of pan of bases and handle lengths. Um, so basically if it's within reason, we can make it. So let's say um, you're a little on the short side, but you're really strong. Maybe you want, an or you want to order an X9000 that has an 8-inch handle instead of a 5-inch one. Maybe you're thinking, eh, my aim's not so great. Maybe you want something that covers a little more area. So you would get um, something with a 13 to 15-inch base instead of a 9 to 11-inch base. We also offer engraving. And so if you're giving a pan as a gift, Maybe you're getting it because it's hers. Maybe you want one from the whole family and they can sort of nestle in like um, Russian nesting dolls. You can get names, dates, occasions, initials. You can get just about anything you want engraved on the pan. Also, first time pan customers receive a DVD with their order. And this DVD demonstrates some basic techniques in using your pan, defending your home, defending your family, yourself, because obviously, you want to know where you're hitting and how to avoid hitting yourself because even though you're much less likely to damage yourself using a gun <coughs> as opposed to a knife, there is, of course, still that option for those who are less coordinated, like myself. Um, but moving on from specifications and customization, we recently got to sit down with a group uh, or some members of our test group. 
and they shared with us their experiences in using PANS, and we want to share a couple of those with you today. The first two people that we got to talk to, our first two test group people, I got to sit down with personally. It's Rapunzel and Flynn Ryder. Um, I don't know if anybody has heard of them or knows them, but they're a pretty famous couple. Um, Rapunzel actually didn't know Flynn for very long, so she was the first one who got to use our can, and she was always told that she couldn't take care of herself. She even Her actual quote, <coughs> full quote said, all my life I was told the world was too scary for me, but once I got out there, my pan helped me take care of myself. So with our product, she was able to face a world that she was afraid of and that she had never been able to go into before and she didn't know if she could handle. So our product was able to help her handle it herself. And uh, going back to the different styles, she had a hybrid because she is a very petite woman. So it just worked best for her. And um, Flynn actually was very funny. He started talking after Rapunzel said it helped her take care of herself and he was rubbing his head and he was like, oh, and boy, can she use it? Because <laughs> when she first met him, she was a little afraid and used it on him as well. Um, his option was the Bludgeoner X9000. And he said that he thought it was really silly, our product at first, but once he got it in his hand, he just thought, I got to get one of these. Um, he was able to win a sword fight with a horse because of our, because of our product and get away from the people who were chasing him and trying to fulfill the bounty on him. So. We also talked to Samwise Gamgee from Hobbiton who said, Elvish blades are all well and good, but I'll always choose my X9000 over anything. <laughs> Mr. Frodo and I would have never made it through Mordor without my pan. And you can see here, he has a custom bludgeon, Bludgeoner X9000. So he's, he's quite strong, but he's obviously a little on the short side. So he went with a model with a, um, a larger base, but a uh, longer handle as well. But that is all the time we have for you. And we thank you guys so much for your time and consideration. And we hope that the next time you are looking at a home defense system, you'll choose a